This week we're live at the Finley Show for a little bit of wood turning. So please stay tuned and enjoy this episode. G'day everyone, welcome along. I'm Dave TTC. And this is Dave's Cave. Well here we are at the Finley Show in country New South Wales. Today I'm doing a live demonstration on my Laguna lathe, how to make table legs uh, from square stock. Initially I turn a major diameter beginning from the corbel and working my way down to the foot. The information supplied to me has been somewhat sketchy. There's been no accurate dimensions or more to the point no dimensions at all. I've been given no lengths, no diameters, not a major diameter, uh, nor the position of the various beads and coves. Going off a relatively blurry picture, I've been able to have a rough guess at some of the proportions and what it is that the customer actually wants. Normally when doing duplicate legs or duplicates of anything, it would be good to make a negative template where you're able to put that up against your work and check that everything is the same. As well as that, a story stick where you're able to put marks directly onto your work once you rough down to the major diameter. I've done neither of these and I'm measuring off each one as I go, comparing it to the first one that I've done. By no means is this the fastest method to get it done, but what I've got here is just some rough timber that was lying in the backyard, some structural Oregon, just to turn a prototype so the client can have a look at it. And I'll probably just make a outdoor coffee table out of these at the end of the day. Should the customer say he's happy, I'll then proceed to do this out of the timber he supplied which is an even larger diameter again. When it came to demonstrating at the show, I am an hard weather taking my big 1836 Laguna was a bit of overkill, but it turned out to be quite a good thing as the other two demonstrators had smaller lathes and I think for a lot of people they found it quite nice for a change to see a larger lathe and something that wasn't just ornamental being turned. We're coming to the final few beads here and it's just about ready to pull out of the lathe and compare it with the ones that have already been done earlier. Again, this was rough stock. It's got rot, uh, as you can see down near the foot there. I hope you've enjoyed this and stay tuned for more wood turning in the future.